Hello everyone, this is Shannon from theirishscrapper.com and today we are creating a cute little card um, using one of the new sets from the Occasions catalog. This is called Bird Banter. Um, it's a very fun set with some images and cute little sayings um, that go with it. So today we're going to be using um, just a little toucan of my appreciation. Um, so I'm using my Stampin' Blends to color the little birds and let's go ahead and get started. For our card base, I am using a piece of Thick Whisper White. Um, this is a much heavier base and it's perfect for card bases. Uh, this is cut 8.5 by 5.5, scored at 4 and a quarter. I have a piece of regular Whisper White that is cut 4 by 5 and a quarter. I have a piece of Soft Sky that is cut 4 by 3. Let me just double check. I was kind of plain. It's a little shy of three inches, um, but it is four so that it's um, flush with the top layer. And then I just have a scrap of Daffodil Delight. And this could be anywhere from um, a half inch to three quarter inch wide. And then you can trim this however you want. You can see on my original, I kind of uh, made it flush with the edge and then I just flagged it on the end. All right, so let's go ahead. We'll start, I think, with our birds. Um, I've already stamped them in the Memento Tuxedo Black ink, and I've uh, fussy cut them out because I knew that would take a little bit of time. Um, so for the Stampin' Blends today, I am using the Light Cherry Cobbler, the Light Bermuda Bay, Light Old Olive, the Ivory, I've got both Daffodil Delights here, dark and light. And then I'm also using the light pool party. All right, so let's start with our light cherry cobbler. On my original, I, I stamped and colored before I fussy cut them out, but for the video purposes, I did it this way. Okay, so I'm going to get this bottom feather. And then I'm just going to do a little bit in the arm here, and we're going to blend some colors together there. Okay, so let me get my Dark Daffodil Delight. And I'm going over that Cherry Cobbler just to, to blend that edge. I'll bring in that Bermuda Bay. Same thing here. I'm running into the Daffodil Delight. Now we'll do this one. I love these blends. Okay, we're going to use the Ivory on his face. You could leave this white if you didn't have the Ivory, but I just thought we'd We'd give him some nice color. We're going to use the light Daffodil Delight on the beak. And this little part right there. And I'm going to do the beak on this one as well. Okay, I'm going to pull back in um, that darker Daffodil Delight. And I'm going to do his hair here. His little feathers. Okay, whoops. And then we're going to use the pool party to color in his body. Just to give him a little soft color. Okay, so our birdies are done. We're going to use this old olive for our leaves. Um, so let me grab the big shot. We're going to emboss our top layer. So this is the Whisper White, the regular. I have my regular Big Shot platform in here. I have one cutting plate. We're going to use the brick wall. And because my card is going to be vertical, I want my bricks running this way. So I'm just going to kind of line that up in here, just like that. I'm going to take the other plate and put that over, run that through. And 
that is our only big shot work today. And then you can see that beautiful brick. All right. Okay, so now we're going to take that piece of soft sky and we are going to stamp our branch. I'm going to take a scrap piece of paper and just lay behind this. I'm going to use the Memento black on this as well. I'm just going to ink that up. Okay, and I'm going to come in um, from this side with this branch. Give that a nice little rub. Now I'm going to re-ink it. And we're going to stamp our other branch. Okay, so I'm just going to sit my toucan here to kind of help me with, you know, placement because this is going to go off. So I'm going to bring this one just to about, you know, towards his face because, you know, you might want to nibble. I'm going to drop that down. Okay. Very good. All right, and like I said, we're going to use that old olive to um, color in our leaves here. I'll do this one too. Okay, and then I'm actually using the Soft Sky ink. And I've taken the small cloud out of the Lift Me Up set. I'm just going to ink this up. And we are going to put a few clouds here. I think my ink pad needs to be re-inked um, across the back of this. Let me get my other little birdie. Yeah, maybe I'll... Do one off the edge here. Okay. All right, so let's start to assemble. Let's set that aside. I'm going to go ahead and use my fast fuse. And we are going to lay this towards the top. Give it at least, you know, one brick. All right, bring in my card base. I'm going to take my fast fuse and I'm going to run this around all four corners because it is embossed. And then we will lay that down just like that. Okay, on my birdies, I'm going to use some dimensionals. So I'm going to put one full size dimensional. I'm going to take a mini and put on his tail and then just one regular on the smaller bird. Okay, so he's going to set there. This one is going to go over here with all his pretty colors. All right, we're going to give this a nice crease while we're at it. Get my bone folder. What a fun set. I like that there's a birthday, there's a thank you, and then just a few, um, you know, punny sayings that coordinate with the birds. So it's a fun set to have. Let me find my Daffodil Delight. We're going to open our memento, and we are going to stamp our sentiment. Just a little toucan of my appreciation. Okay. And then I'm going to take a peek here, like I said. Um, yeah, we're going to line it up. I'm going to stamp one more leaf. There's a single leaf that matches the leaf here from our branch. So I'm going to put that on the edge. And we're going to color that in. And I'm 
just going to eyeball here. Take my scissors, I'm gonna snip off about that. I'm going to cut up the middle, cut in from the corner. And just flag that. Just like that. And then we'll add our fast fuse. Make sure my card is straight. And there you go. There is our fun card for today. I love this little set. It's very nice um, set. I think that I will use a lot. I love that they're is this balloon and like I said the birthday sentiment so you can do lots of different backgrounds and fun things or just add the bird to another um, card or set that you have. Um, so if you would like any of today's supplies please head on over to the description of this video you will find a full supplies list and don't forget we are in celebration so for every $50 order you earn free products and if you spend 100 there are um, tier 2 products um, so there's some awesome things in the celebration and you can use the January hostess code I will put up on the screen and I look forward to being back with you real soon. Take care. Bye bye.